<laughs> Every single day going home, you, you know, go. I haven't, you know, kind of like kiss or hug my daughter for two, three weeks. I go home, shower, go up to my own room. It is really hard. It's that mix of heartache, fear of the unknown, and frustration that led a group of roughly a dozen and a half nurses to stand in silence and in solidarity outside of the entrance of Regional Medical Center in San Jose Wednesday morning. We don't want to be spreading it ourselves, so we just want to have the right um, PPEs. Their pleas are the same as other nurses, doctors, and healthcare staff all across the country. They need more protective equipment, and they need it now. I'm in the room taking care of a patient who is COVID positive. I'm wearing that one mask and then if I have to go into another room to take care of a patient who is a potentially rule out for COVID-19, then I'm exposing that patient. With what few N95 masks these nurses tell me they are provided by Regional Medical Center, they're required to reuse them for days at a time. We have to reuse them for one, one each day and uh, the next day and the next day and the next day until it goes bad. They acknowledge that Governor Newsom and leaders in the Bay Area are doing their best to acquire more protective equipment for those on the front line, but they question if more and more public servants fall ill, who will be there to serve the public? We need the help to protect us, to protect our patient, our loved one at home or the community as a whole.